Hey Stinger here. Uh, this video is going to show you how to do a uh, glitch using the knife lunge glitch. And what you do is get on top of this container, and none of the zombies can get you. Now, this is like for beginners. I'm going to show you how to do this knife lunge. What you need to do is you need to switch weapons. You need to get your crosshairs red. Hit the button to switch weapons, which is your Y button on the Xbox, then the B, then the Y. And what that does is it makes you lunge. And I don't know if anybody ever noticed that sometimes when you're going to knife a zombie you fly forward really far and lunge at them and I never really knew why that happened but apparently you get charged up by the zombie and it makes you shoot forward and when you put yourself up against a wall like this and knife it it'll shoot you up onto things uh, this isn't the only place you can do it but this is probably the easiest place and as you can see I'm making my crosshairs red I'm hitting YBY real fast YBY YBY that charges up like right now YBY YBY and then I go up here and there's a bullet hole on the side of that container that you look at you push forward like you're running into it and then you knife it and the lunge into the side of that container shoots you up on top and it works best there needs to be that zombie close to you it needs to be right down there on the other side of the container because the game in order to lunge at a zombie has to see something there to lunge at and George helps out. Now this is solo, so I could show you the tutorial. But you can do it multiplayer, and that's pretty much what, if I ever use it, it's more or less just to show off. Like I'll get a crawler over here while everybody's somewhere else, and I'll get up here, and then when they're running around looking for the crawler, they'll come across the, the front of the boat here and see me up on the container and be like, hey, how'd you get up there? But it takes some practice doing this right here. The YBY. YBY. And it doesn't work all the time. And then you just look here and you knife. See, I almost got up there. And you just keep doing it until you get up on it. Uh, it takes a lot. I mean, you can get it down to science, I guess. But for me, I just keep doing what you see me doing here. Just YBY and then getting up on the uh, container. Now you can do it on the other side of the door. Sometimes it's easier for people to do it on the other side. I, but uh, I do it on this side. I missed it there again. You don't have to push forward that hard like you're running into it. But I like to push forward and up a little bit. It seems to work for me. And you'll get your own uh, little way to do it. But like I said, you know, it's I'll show you what you do once you're up there. I mean, it's kind of neat, but then again, it's kind of like boring. Like most glitches are boring, but it's fun to have somebody come running up here and you'd be, you'd be jumping up and down on top of the container. They'd be like, how'd you get up there? So here I am up on it. Sometimes it seems easy, sometimes it seems hard. Uh, see, I couldn't get it that time. Sometimes you think you'll never get back up on it. But then you do. So let me show you uh, what we do once we're up on it. Okay, I'm up on it. Now what's going to happen is when you start the round, all the zombies are going to come running, especially since it's solo. 
not as much if you got a bunch of people playing but there they are they all gathered up inside the container now you just go to town on them uh, if you got like uh, scavenger you know some kind of explosive weapon mustangs maybe you can pretty much hoard them in there and blow them to pieces all at once the law upgraded is really nice and you really don't want to shoot them you saw a lot of them outside the container once you jump back on top of it they all go running from outside to into it only so many of them can get in there at a time you want to try not to sh kill them outside the container and I'll show you why next time I jump over here and uh, blast them out from inside the container we'll uh, get a power up in there Okay, I got a max ammo sitting there. I want to get that. But I sure as heck ain't going to get down to get it. Especially if I'm in a high round. So all you do is jump up. And I'm going to wait a little bit. But you, basically you just get on top of it and it gives it to you. Bang. Works with everything. So that's that glitch. Um, here's the other glitch on the stairs. I know... It's not a knife glitch. You can turn it off now if you already know this glitch. Everybody knows this glitch, but you don't want to ever open up the bottom door down here. I know if you're a newbie, everybody always don't open the door at the bottom of the lighthouse. Don't open the door at the bottom of the lighthouse. But in order for the glitch to work, you got to have this door open and the door down there that I opened. Uh, usually, you'll be coming from spawn. And coming down into here, opening that door. You'll be coming down through here. 750 to open the boat over there. 1,000 for this door. 1,000 for this door. So basically 2750 to get to the glitch. Now how to get in the glitch? Here it is. Never open that door. If the door's open, the glitch don't work. You want to line your crosshairs up. There's a million ways to get in this. You want to line it up with the edge of the step. I like to get in it that way because if I'm getting in it in the middle of a round, I'm running up to it. And I like to get it lined up before I turn around. See, I'll come running up and get it lined up. And get down in it. you got to be crouching down to get in it. You can stand up once you're in it. But basically that's it. The zombies aren't going to get you. They'll never come get you unless somebody run, runs them close to you. Or somebody runs a herd close to you and knocks you off. Now the thing about this glitch is if you got somebody running down below you right here and they go down, they can crawl up to you and you can revive them. So they'll never die as long as they stay in range of crawling up to you. And if you get the AK, you can just run up, get ammo, and get back on as you need it. Now you can see I'm in the glitch. I just pissed George off. He's going to go running. And he's going to run the same way the zombies run when they're in this glitch. Up through there. And he's going to come to this door and just stand there. So once the zombies do that they load up at that door and you just blast at them through the door I really don't try and shoot them down in front of me down here I wait till they get to the door and then uh, blast away now why do you use this glitch well mainly for people that want to do the Easter egg I put them inside the lighthouse and we make a ton of points open up all the doors get the right guns and then do the Easter egg and then after that they're on their own because I personally don't sit in these glitches I just like to uh, run the map I got a couple spots on this map I like to run but if you're in round like 30 and you go down for some reason you can get back in the game if you sit in this glitch because you won't need jugs or anything and then you just make points, save a crawler, and get back in the game. 
Now the way to do that is you put a couple guys inside the where inside the lighthouse. I always call it the warehouse for some reason. Put it inside. The, put them in the lighthouse, and I'll show you what happens from the inside. But basically, you can see my points just piling up as I'm shooting. I got the AK off the wall now. And just go to town. And when a power up comes up like that one, you just run up to the door. Don't open the door. Don't hit X. Just run up to the door. You can get it through the door. It's an insta kill. Get back on the glitch. Luckily, it's an insta kill, or else I'd be out running right now, probably. But, you know, if you can get in and out of it fast, you can do that pretty much through the whole game. So, I'm going to show you what to do when you got guys inside the lighthouse. Because if you're inside the lighthouse, you, you're having just as much fun killing them as I am right there. So you got a guy outside on the steps in the glitch. You can have one or two guys in here. If the back door's open, I suggest two guys. If it's not open, one guy can pretty much handle it. But basically, all you got to do is the zombies are going to come down the steps and go right to the door and pile up. They will not come after you as long as you stay away from the steps. Watch that window. Watch this window. Sometimes they'll come out of the window and go to the door. Sometimes they'll come out of the window and come to you. If you stand here, you can watch both windows and pound the door with your gun and get points at the same time. At the end of the round, you throw a grenade at the door, make a crawler, go out and do what you got to do. Sometimes if the back door is open, you can stand right here. They'll come from that window over there and go to the door. They'll come from the back door and either split off and come towards you or go the other way and go to the door. So that's pretty much it. I'd like to leave that door closed as long as possible till the box goes back there. But I hope you like what you saw. You know, I hope you learned something. 